Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this Beast Phone Case DIY. This one is actually pretty easy to make and they look super cute. So I'm just gonna start off with this uh, phone case. This is just one flexible. This one used to be cleared just so you can get an idea of how much I've used it. You can start off with a white one if you prefer, but I'm gonna be painting this using this acrylic paint. I love this uh, shade of like teal turquoise. I don't know what this is, but this is the name of it. And I'm just gonna be using my brush, covering the whole thing and giving this few coats until it's opaque enough. And this is how I'm letting it dry in between coats. For the bees, I'm going to be first making a template with my uh, mechanical pencil and a piece of paper, and I'm just gonna draw first an oval shape make it as big or as small as you want them to be like the bees and then i'm just going to draw some wings but i actually forgot to you know draw the stinger and so i just do it at the end with my sharpie but yeah i'm just going to be cutting that and then i'm going to be using this foamy paper for some like dimension on the phone case putting my template on top of my foamy paper and i'm just going to trace the shape i'm going to cut that so you just cut it for times this shape. I'm just going to be painting my bees using like yellow, black and white acrylic paint and my brush. So I'm just going to be painting the wings first in white, giving them few coats. Once it's sun and dry, I'm just going to be painting the body of the bee and again giving this few coats and covering the whole thing, like even the sides as well. Once that's dry, I'm just going to be taking my Sharpie and I'm just going to be working first with the finest tip that they get, drawing the lines and then covering the um, the rest, like the stripes that they got. I'm going to be making the face as well by adding a small dot in a smile. And again, covering the body of the bee on like the edges. And then I just wanted to add some dimension to the bees by cutting the middle part. I should have done this before I painted the whole thing, but I thought about it uh, after I painted them. You can pretty much open like the wings to make them seem like they are flying. And I'm just going to be arranging the bees as I want them to be, but I'm just putting them like on top without gluing them. I'm going to be taking some white acrylic paint, my toothpick, and I'm just going to be drawing like the effect of the flight of the bee. I've seen people do this effect with like lines. I don't know, I just wanted to go for mini dots just because I find them cuter but feel free to paint those like mini lines if you prefer. So once it's done I'm just going to be taking this glaze glass by Sculpey and I'm just going to be covering the whole thing just to make this part of the phone case shiny and glossy. This one has a squeeze bottle. To be honest I prefer to work with like spray glosses because you don't see like the strokes of the brush but for now this is what i'm using giving the thick coats until it's shiny enough i'm just going to be uh, using my super glue and i'm just going to glue the bees on top of like the glossy part this is because i want to check the contrast of like the shiny gloss and the bees that are not like in real life glossy at all if you want your bees to be shiny just go with shine after you're done gluing them but yeah guys this is pretty much the uh, phone case that i want to share with you this is before i realized i was missing the stingers i just drew them after this actually they still look cute i think but to me they look like tiny fishes more than bees but i just wanted to leave both just so you can see which one you like the most if you like it better with the stinger just add it with uh, some sharpie i honestly love love this one. It's really cute, but it's also really easy to do. This phone case actually makes me smile every time I see it. I think it's a happy one, as silly as it sounds. And I love the contrast of the bees with like the colored background. But yeah, I just wanted to share this with you. I love it. Hopefully you like it too. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out more phone cases that I have on my channel and subscribe for more. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys!